we're out of here. We're not ever seeing that lady again. What's over, ooh, what is this? Remodeled, not as, I don't know what that says. So not as something as last year. I guess not as, not as rough as last year. I would hope so. Bebby the Clown, Carnival Kerfuffle. This can't be good, can it? I can't imagine this will turn out good in any way, shape, or form. Oh, wow, you are creepy. You are creepy. Like, I mean, I don't really have it, like a doubt. A clown fear, but he just doesn't look like he has a face. Like, I don't know. All right, well. Oh, you, you, you over there. I can parry over you. You, that is, they definitely tease that a fair amount. I can't hit him. Am I doing that wrong? Hmm, I'm, I'm definitely doing something wrong there. Okay, now you're a balloon. And there are balloon animals attacking me. Okay, I, I see what's going on here. Utter fear. Oh, you're, you're, I can get you maybe, or not. See, I don't know if I should be switching to the, uh, to the, uh, the other shot. I think I will in a moment. Just let me get that real quick. And then I'm just gonna worry about this because this is just so great about the green shots. I just don't have to worry about it, you know? I'm almost at five though. I can blast him in just a moment. Um, just do that and then, what, what? I was holding up. <laughs> okay, note to self, it doesn't work that way. I was holding the up button. I was hoping he would just shoot it up. What, did we get him? Oh, maybe that's his first phase or his second phase. Cause you know, he was on the, the, the bumper car before. Well, okay, these fall to the floor. I gotta find the gap in between. All right, hey, 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 that was a lot of stuff right there. Speed run, yep. We're gonna f finish the game in the world record time. 17 hours. All right, okay, okay, I understand. So this guy, uh, okay, we gotta start that one <laughs> We're doing the clown, or we're taking him out. All right, so he sort of really teases it. Ah, I got it now. Gotta be careful, because some of them drop like little light bulb, so I don't wanna hit this dude, because then he starts spinning and then I can't parry him. He's doing a little dance, and it just gets it really confusing. Stop with the little bumper car dance. All right, he does a little horn honk. I gotta listen out for the horn honk. I think I could do this with extra HP. If I, if I really get called up on it, I'll move back to Smoke Bomb. But so far, so good. I think, I don't have any other options for Super, I don't think because I don't have anything that'll hit him, so I might have to just wait for a different phase. Oh, oh, couldn't quite get that one, that's fine, that's fine. Oh, oh I didn't see him, all oh, that stinks. Oh. Destroying as many balloons as I can. All right, boom. Okay, move it, oh, that was not bad. I like these guys who are just enjoying the roller coaster, like, yeah, this is a good time. Don't even realize it's not part of the ride. All right, so I have my super duper, but I'm gonna wait until he's in a, you know, a place where I can reach him. All right, like that. Have this from me to you, a gift for this holiday season. Okay, whoa, that's not fair. <laughs> that is all heavy at once. The extra HP is surely coming in handy, though. I would have been taken out at this point. Like, I know I could dodge over it, but at the same time, oh wow, we're only halfway through. Knock, knock, who's there? Charlie, Charlie who, Charlie horse? I guess he's. What, I guess the horse is named Charlie? I have no true, uh, no clue what that's supposed to mean. Uh, dodge it! That's good. And then, oh, that hurt. That, I feel like I wanna retry this now. All right, um. Ooh! Not bad, I don't know if the light bulbs that we can knock off of those dudes, if they can actually hurt the clown as well. There we go, you gotta listen for that honk. I listened for it. The pink dog goes like Courage Cowardly Dog. It totally does. Of course, Courage, that's a fun fun show. All right. So you go into balloon form, and you shoot out your balloon form dogs, and then I can jump over that. So now we're almost already at full. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. So will we be able to earn up enough coins to get every ability? I would hope so. I would hope that we wouldn't have to pick and choose, and then if, as long as we keep getting all the coins in a level, because I think we've gotten all the coins and all the running gun levels so far. Okay. I don't need the card extra parry stuff. Oh boy, oh boy. Yep, that was good. All right. Oh boy. Oh boy, as long as we can just survive this balloon part, I think I can make it easier from here. Especially since I'm going into this part with three HP instead of two. Oh, you're this way now. 
thanks. I I was in the air when I pressed the button, but hey, at least it's getting you in the toes, right? Oh no. Well, that was a waste. <laughs> He's having a good time up there, I gotta say. It's like a kid at a carnival. What do you know? I mean, that's all he just wants to be, is just enjoying the carnival forever. Well, you chose a good profession being a clown. That was a little silly. Whoa, we got this phase done. That's not all of it, though, because they didn't go, bravo! Oh, oh, what in the world is happening? You know what? Oh yeah, I forgot I didn't have the full thing. For some reason, I thought I had super. I did not have super. Well, now I have this going on. This is, is this a shield, I guess? This will protect me? Okay, now you're a carousel. That makes sense. That's a totally sensical thing to understand. All right, wow, this is so easy to get mixed up because you can't see the apex of his jump, so you just totally lose out on the trajectory of where he's going and what he's doing, and that is just so bizarre to me. Oh, gosh. What do you call a cup that falls off a swing? A tumbler. I don't get these jokes. Maybe they're just out of my, my, I don't know. Out of my lifespan. Seems like a very old clown. Oh, boy. Come on, come on. Well, that didn't work. Oh. Nightmare feel the boss fight? Sort of, okay, so the ducks actually can hit you. I actually wasn't aware of that. I guess I've already done a good job of hitting them. So I'll try one more time with the extra HP, and then we can maybe try the smoke bomb, since people were asking. All right. Let's get a listen for that honk, and we'll be A-OK. -okay. Just like that. Shoot that. Yeah, that didn't seem to do anything to him. <laughs> he don't care. He's protected by the car. Oh, okay, well, I thought I was gonna be able to parry off the duck. I should have just ignored the duck, but... You wish I had affiliate? Hopefully at some point. You never know. Oh, boy. Oop, ah, oh. okay. We'll try, we'll try the, the bomb. Or not the bomb, the smoke bomb. That might be a bit easier for me. Let's exit to map. Because the extra HP isn't gonna get me too far if I can't use the HP in a good spot, and there definitely is some stuff I'm missing out on here. Uh, so let's go to our charm. I really wish we could apply two charms, but, and I'm getting the full super pretty well. We have so much to do in World 2, holy cow. Don't even wanna think about it. All right, creepy clown, you're going down. Going down with the creepy clown. Oop. Yeah, okay. Now I don't have to worry about dodging that as much, but I of course still wanna be careful and be sure but I think this is, I know I've been using this weapon for most of it. I can probably switch to this here. But it's like when I have to reposition is when things get problematic. Oh, you got me, you little, you little duck. He's just spinning around like, yeah, I got him. All right, so, so he has, seems to have four phases and he has this, he has another thing after this. Let's go back into this. Oh boy. He has the, he's on the horse and then he becomes a carousel. Not too many opportunities for me to use the super where I can actually reach it. So I think the best bet is to do it in this third phase I'm about to hit. Boom, there you go. I'm glad the parrying does actually give you more of the card. I mean, it'd be weird if it didn't. And then what would be the point? Okay. I like the happy little moon in the background. He's like, I'm having a good time. Hit you like this, I have one HP, so I'm probably gonna get hit or not. Okay, cool. All right, boom. That was pretty good of me. Usually don't do that so well. Get that, and then you're still on your horse. Dodge that, that was decent, that was decent. Okay, so we got him there. I don't know, what, why he's screaming like that. The little horse reminds me of Goofy. Okay. It's crazy, because it's like, I know that a lot of this is referencing old cartoons, but a lot of it's like you'd think would be a little bit more obvious in like some of it's like old school Mickey references, or maybe I just didn't watch as much Mickey Mouse as I thought I did. It's not about, I'm not, like I feel like there's more references here than I'm actually noticing. So we're back to the one HP situation here, which I don't appreciate, because these baseballs are everywhere. Oh gosh, okay, that took him out. You know what I'm gonna do then? Have that, have that, have that, and then I think I have one more? I do, okay. Oh, oh. Okay, just focus on dodging. Oh, excuse me, sirs. Thank you. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I'm still doing this. I'm still, I'm still kicking. All right, just keep damaging you. You have to be low, right? Boom, hit you with that. That was pretty good. It's hard enough to stay up here because I'm trying to move to the left. Oh, darn, we had to be close. We were so close. 
Holy cow, that was as close as you could get without winning, isn't it? Yeesh. Okay, I have to check something really quick before we continue onwards. Okay, we're good, we're good. But don't worry, if we could do it once, we could do it again. I'm probably surely brewing indeed. So I'm gonna shoot you with the normal attacks this time, because I think I can handle it just fine. But it seems like that might be my best bet is to just, oh, you know, we gotta restart that. <laughs> But I think that my best bet will be to use all of the smaller supers once we get to that point. Oh, okay. Let's not get messed up on the easy stuff now. I know how to do it, I just gotta do it. All right, honk, jump, good. All right, I love how every time you shoot, it also makes like a little snap noise. I gotta remember, I can also shoot up, I shouldn't have shot that. I can shoot up diagonally. I always sort of forget that. I think there's only four ways of shooting. I guess three, left, right, and up. All right, well, I'm gonna jump on you. That'll be nice. Jump on your nose. Okay. Okay, well, sorry, Mr. Dog. I mean, I guess I shouldn't be sorry. You attacked me. Okay, jump off of that. That'll be good. So I have five now. Seems like it makes a little noise when you have five, but it's a really subtle noise. And I don't wanna use it now. I gotta use it in the next phase. So now I just gotta keep surviving. Oop. Okay, hold on. Aw, oh, you little passengers with your sharp, evil teeth. I'm already down to one HP. Why can't I ever get to this last phase with more than one HP? It would be so nice if I could. You're eating breakfast at this time? It's like nighttime for me. All right. Now, oh, come on. That was all me. That was all me. He looks so happy, but so evilly happy. There you go. See, that's all I need to do for the most part. Especially, like, I should not, I have no excuse to get hit in the bumper cars at this point. So he just drops that on you if, if it's on, okay. All right. Oh. oh, too early, too early. If I can't get past the bumper cars without getting hit, it ain't happening. So I just gotta keep trying. That was good, that was good. I'm glad to see that. I think I need to have this on the auto hit then. If I need to get rid of these ducks that are going to end up dropping stuff on me, like that ain't no good. So focus on what I got going on here. The fire goes away relatively quickly though, so that's pretty good. By the time I actually have to worry about if I'm gonna land on it or not. There we go. Oh, hey, we got him. Okay, I wish I didn't hit that, but I did. Okay, he's so creepy. He's got that weird kind of happy, you know? The creepy, happy smile. I can't believe I didn't get hit there. Like, typically that's where I get hit, is when stuff is that close. Okay, so I could try to land on you. Oh, I almost landed on the spikes of the train car there. I don't know if they can actually hit you or not, but I'm going to assume that they can. Okay, move it, move it, move it. All right, boom. Move it. Oh, darn it. The little balloon dog, but I have two HP. As long as I can survive the next phase, I mean, there's a bunch of horseshoes in the next phase, so the chances of me surviving it are very low. But I mean, I got as far as I did last time all with one HP. It's just so difficult. I think that's gonna be a repeated theme throughout the entire series, especially if those boomerangs move so incredibly quick at first. Wow, I feel like it's more difficult than last time. I feel like it is more difficult than last time. But that might just be me. All right, you get ready to do your thing and I get hit. <laughs> no, why? We were so close that one time, why can't that be this time and I just be aware? All right, you know what? That was good, that was good. That was good as well. Nice and ready for it. Honk, honk, dodge. Nice. Get that duck if I can. Nice, okay. He should be down and out in just a couple more hits. Oh man, too early again. Okay, I'm gonna, since it was like right at the end of that phase, I will hold on here. I guess you can sort of tell when the roller coaster is coming because you can see it coming in the background, which is actually a really nice touch. I think that's really cool. Whoop. All right, excuse me, Mr. Doggies. I couldn't get you, but I tried. We only need one more card until we're at max. I don't need to land on every doggy. I mean, I think I actually will be fine with how I am right here. Uh, yeah, it's filling up. There it is, okay, so now I have max. And if not, I would have gotten it right then. Landing on the roller coaster's nose is actually relatively easy. That, that, that was unnecessary. All right, well. 
I got this dude. See, this time he actually threw easier to dodge boomerangs. I wish he could do that more often, but he doesn't seem too interested. I wish I could have gotten both of those, the nose and the horseshoe. But hey, that's fine. So now he's on this side, and I need to just be able to dodge these, because if I could build up another super, that'd be fantastic. Okay, I'm so glad I timed that correctly. We have three cards going into this. If maybe I can play my cards right, I could maybe just maybe be able to, uh, what's it called? Have another ultra super, an EX for this, but at the same time, do I really wanna risk it? I mean, I guess I do. Oh, I should have hit that, but at the same time, that would have been noticeably difficult. Oh boy, so intense. Also, I like how he doesn't open his mouth. Instead, his teeth move out of the way. I mean, maybe I should be focusing on taking these guys out the train, the roller coaster car. And I had my super duper. Oh. oh, so close. All right, I almost forgot the button for, uh, for dodging. I just sort of pressed multiple buttons at once. It worked out some, that's fine. Oop! Got it, got it. I like how the roller coaster, not the roller coaster, but the bumper car also has eyes and he sort of just looks instant. Are you kidding me? What was with that, Mr. Duck? I pressed the jump and you got hit at the same time. But the, 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 the bumper car's eyes look so innocent. He's like, I don't even want to be here. This guy cruised me out too. Oh. Oh. Because everything looks so sinister in this level except for the bumper car. So I'm already down to one HP. Chance of me surviving astronomically low. The chance of me trying anyway is very high. Cool. Come on now. Jump on that for sure. I'm gonna jump off of you. We definitely have all five cards. Sometimes I'm a little too busy to look. I don't like this weapon sometimes, so I'm just going back to this. Go, go, go. Perfect, perfect, perfect. So I gotta be ready for this. He's gonna shoot those horseshoes. Hit him now. Perfect as well. Because now he's gonna shoot up the initial. That is not cool. That is not cool at all. I got hit early though. I should have expected it. I need to have some tea first. Maybe some extra tea will help me focus here. It'll help me be more prepared this time. Ah, oh, man. You gotta jump a little bit with that. The smoke dash doesn't seem far enough to get across the entirety of the bumper cars, so unless you time it very well. It just, it's just better to, you know, use the auto aim. Never give up, never surrender, that's what I'm saying. All right. I mean, we, we are getting in general better. I'm getting to the final wave of it a lot easier, and hey, we beat that candy lady. If we could do that, we could do this. And I feel like that'll be like the big thing for me, you know, surviving in this game without going too insane, is that if I can do one of these things, one of these bosses, I can do the rest of them. Right? If I can beat the can leader, I can beat the, the, the clown guy. If I can beat the clown guy, I can beat whatever boss is next, you know? It's all about that. Using your experiences to your benefit. Oh, I almost got a double parry there. That would have been so cool. I haven't done that since the tutorial. <laughs> I don't think it was too impressive then. Let me get you and then start getting rid of you guys again. So now I almost have the full card. I just need to ruin my chances. Come on. This seems like a pretty easy spot to earn up the five cards, that's why we've got it every time, except for I get hit on the silliest things. Get rid of you guys, come on. Now that the roller coaster is gone, here's my good chance. Oh, my intention is so focused. So I'm sorry, once again, if I missed any messages, I am sorry, ah, oh, the stinking car. I should have saw it coming, but I didn't. I definitely need to just not get hit here. If I get hit here, it's basically over. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, good. I love his animation though. Like when he turns a little bit, you can actually see like his jaw sort of has like a delayed action, like he's hanging his jaw. Like attention to detail like that in the animation in this game is fantastic. Like in a purely frame by frame animation, inspecting it, I feel like this probably is one of the most impressive games I've ever seen. There you go. I mean, even just displays of animation, you don't see classic animation like this because it's expensive and time consuming to produce. That's a reason it doesn't look like this anymore. Oh boy. Now let's try to get rid of these guys if we can. Oh, 
And then I'm ready for you. Yeah, I was waiting for that this time, huh? I was, like that's sort of another thing that's super frustrating about this part is you have to pay attention to multiple things. You need to pay attention to the background and know when that train's coming or just have fast enough reactions. But chances are you're already focusing on some other things. So horseshoes are gonna be shot out. Now I can hit you with this. Okay, so th those are all gonna fall. But that's okay because I forgot to press the jump button for the parry. That's not okay. And I'm dead. <laughs> oh my gosh. You got to this guy. Yeah, this guy is so difficult. It's insane. It's endless possibility. That's true. This game gives you anxiety. I'm sorry. It does for me too. But it won't be all we're playing today. Oh boy. Come on now. Oh, I always mess that up. I really should not even try with that little ducky. Oh, that was almost too early. Okay, we actually got through this phase without taking a hit for once. Yeah, I can actually see how you could end up dying thousands of times in this game. I mean, that's how it was like for other super difficult platformers. Super Meat Boy comes to mind. I can't believe I got hit there. That was unnecessary. All right, well, at least I'm down to two HP and not one. So the train car is about to come again. Be ready for it. It's just sometimes the doggies will just overwhelm me. They just pop up in just the worst spot. I guess for them, just the right spot. What did I get hit with? See, that's what I mean. That is what I mean. And I just, I wish the auto aim shots were doing a little bit better. But they are not. Okay, so you're out of here. The train car might still be coming, so I gotta be ready for it. And then, oh, I might end up landing right on the spike of that. I didn't actually, cool. All right, so I gotta be careful here, but the super will surely help. That was great right there. I'm glad I actually landed on that. And you're moving to the left side now, but the train car's about to come, I think. Oh, it's on its way. It is certainly on its way. So I gotta be careful, because it's about to pop up. Train car, here you are. Boom, hey, that rhyme. Train car, here you are. Whoop. So he's just sitting here in disarray, like, ow. So I don't know if I can actually hit him there. And does a creepy laugh. Nah, I don't know if anybody's counting how many times I've died, but it'll all be uploaded, so I guess anybody can watch back. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. At this point, I'm very torn on I should whether I should wait or not. All right, there we go, there we go. I mean, I'm still only at one HP. Oh, where, I didn't, I didn't even know what happened there. I just totally lost where my character was. I can't believe I actually got that parry, but if I could have survived after that, Oh, zero death, yep. It's all been an illusion. Actually, this, this is just my practice run, nothing counts. Oh, no, I thought he was gonna back up more. I gotta get past that first wave without getting hit. Every HP is precious. Zero deaths. Oh. All right. Mr. Clown, you're going down. This is what's gonna happen, you gotta accept it. Okay, okay, whoop, I, I hit your noggin there. You think, you know, some logic would carry over from other platformers, I land on his head, it should be a Goomba stomp. Well, goodbye. All right, so the roller coaster's actually be coming in just a second. Oh, right there. Man, is this dude tough or what? I mean, I feel like we haven't spent as long with him as we have the candy lady, but it's coming up. It's coming up for sure. The way he looks around with those creepy eyes too. Like this guy is just the scariest boss yet. I mean, I have a feeling they'll be scarier because there's just something about old school cartoons that can be rather creepy at times, especially some of the really old black and white ones are just awfully creepy. Can't believe I got hit there. But at the same time, I'm starting to get less and less surprised about getting hit. Yeah, the candy lady was indeed somebody, something else. Insanity, and that actually hits you. I can't control how high I jump off the nose. I guess the idea is then not to hop off the nose then. Okay, be as ready as I can. Go into the auto aim now, my best bet. And, oh, that was good, that was good. All right, and go. See, now I think I've got him. He's about to get taken out here in a moment. I might have an extra chance. Oh, I missed my chance to parry. There you go, okay, so got through that without taking any damage. Already two cards in. Oh. 
Oh, I should have went right, I went left. So I just gotta expect getting hit here. If I could just find a way to, I mean, sometimes I actually do avoid getting hit during the boomerang sections. It just usually, unfortunately, is the time that I get hit twice before that. So if I could find a way to not get hit here, I mean, that's easier said than not, I've already gotten hit here. But if I could find a way to not get hit here anymore, and then not get hit the boomerang section, which seems to be total luck, depending on which boomerang you get. Come on. All right, we almost have all five cards. It'll happen in just a second. Oh, wow, okay. There it is, there it is. Ready? Boom. So now I just have to avoid boomerangs for as long as physically possible. I missed out on one of the one of the parries, but I got one in, in its stead, so. So now if we could just survive this for as long as physically possible. See, that's easy to dodge. That right there is easy to dodge. Without the train car, easy peasy. Okay, there you go. Waiting for this, boom. See, that doesn't do anything. That didn't get me any more progress, so that parry really wasn't worth it. All right, Cuphead. Me and you, buddy. Me and you. Let me go ahead into this right now. There we go. That's not too bad, actually. Maybe I should be sticking to this a bit more than I am. When I start dodging like crazy, which I'm about to do, I'll go ahead and switch to the auto aim. But just to get a little bit of extra damage in, because I surely need it. Okay, well, there goes my one HP. I would have been done there normally. Let's go into our super. Super. Super again. Don't forget the extra super. And then one extra super. No, I don't have it. <laughs> I had to try, right? Okay, okay, okay. We can still do this. This is still very possible. It's doable. It's doable. Dodge that baseball. Why baseball? See now? What do they like so much about baseball? I mean, it's a great sport. Don't get me wrong. No, oh, we did it. Yes. Okay. Holy cow. Oh. Trust the heart of the cards. I mean, I think we have diamond cards, but yes. Trust the heart of the cards. This is Yu-Gi-Oh! <laughs> okay, we did it! Oh my gosh, we didn't fill up our super meter. What are we gonna get, like a C minus, B plus? I mean, that's a passing grade. You keep doing that, you'll get an honor roll. Maybe you'll get a boost in your allowance, Cuphead. I mean, is the title, Kettle Guy like his grandpa? I'm not really sure. I think that's the real, the real story here, is that Cuphead just needs more father figures in his life. He needs a real role model. You know? Okay, so, oh, we can even go down here. What is this about? Ah, hello, l large nose guy. Throughout of all of your battles and all of my rhymes, you have failed and perished 59 times. Nice to know. So we're under 100, baby. Woo! So there's that done. So we've defeated Candy Lady and Clown Man. I guess I can go through here. Haven't found your brother. Ooh, what's this? Jimmy? Ooh, that's a hard one to pronounce. Jimmy the Great in Pyramid Peril. Let's try it. I need, I need to do another running gun level soon. I want more coins. Like I knew that there was gonna be a lot less running gun levels than boss fights, but I didn't think there was gonna be this little running gun levels. Whoa, this is so cool. They have the, the, the stop motion miniature. Oh, that is so awesome. Whoa. Oh my gosh. I'm such a like stop motion nerd, first off. I mean, I feel like I could be more of a stop motion nerd, but this guy is so cool, I really like this. So obviously a lot of the, if you guys don't know, a lot of old movies. Oh, I gotta shoot the face, don't I? Yep, look at that, look at that. But a lot of old movies, you know, you see this awesome action scene. And it'll be like over, like a, it'll be like a sky view and it's like, how did they do that? A lot of the times, especially back in the days where cameras were like the size of cars, they didn't put a camera inside of the, uh, and a helicopter, instead they actually remade that area, but to a smaller scale, like somebody made a model of it. And you see that on the movies, I was watching, what was the movie I was watching? Uh, a couple weeks ago with Michaela that actually had that, and I noticed while watching, it was my first time watching the movie, that it was a miniature, and she's like, how did you know? And I was like, I don't know, I guess I like that kind of stuff. But oh, it's Beetlejuice. That's a weird movie, I pressed the wrong button. <laughs> Do you need to borrow my sarcophagus? I, I might, I might. Oh, I didn't want to exit the map? No, I pressed the wrong button. Especially the Lego stop motions, yeah. That was a lot of really cool Lego stop motions. I'm a really big fan of those. Personally, I'm not very good at making stop motions because I'm clumsy as you could possibly be, but I really appreciate the art form because it's very meticulous. And I think some of the Wallace and Gromit movies are stop motion, I might be wrong about that though. Whoa, okay, hold on, hold on. This is different than last time. Oh, these are like little cat, uh, cat beetles. What are, the, what are these beetles called? Uh, scarabs. 
This is really cool. This might be like, artistically, it might be my favorite boss so far. I also like how it's a little maze to the pyramid. Makes me curious, like, can you solve the maze? I'm sure if you paused it, you could, but it might be a bit difficult with the angling. Ow, that hurt. I really shouldn't be getting hit on these. Oh, so even the little totems, like just touching them will hurt you. Okay, well, that's good to keep in mind. Down to one HP. Okay, I'm just trying to remember what buttons I can press because I, this is only our second ever flying mission. All right, so that's what I wanted to do last time and I actually just did the go in, like the little miniature version thing. All right, so it's gonna go like that. Oh my gosh, just barely dodge that. So it's gonna go like that. Okay, how did I dodge that? I'm not really sure. Can I? I'm trying to, I think I can parry some of these ghosts, but it's honestly very hard to tell. Oh. Retry. Used to do Lego stop motions. Uh, the, the, they're all so cool. I, I, like I said, I've never been very good at them. I've never tried them too much, but I appreciate the art form. Even like, even the ones that like maybe aren't the best are obviously from people who are still new to the art form are still, you can tell like it takes so much time. You can't make it not seem like, you know, there was some heart put into it. I think that's one thing that's really cool about it. Is that no matter how lazy you're being with stop motion, you have to put in a fair, okay, we're gonna restart this one. You have to put in a fair amount of effort for it to even really be considered a stop motion before it's just a picture slideshow. All right, oh, this is new. So it seems like the starting phase can be a bit different. Oh. You need to get the second weapon. It's right next to the boss. Okay. So like there's another shop. Hmm. Okay, I keep getting hit by these. I was doing so well the first round when I was actually distracted. But I'll try to get as many weapons as I can. Now that I know you can only have one charm at a time and I like the charms that I have, I don't, oh really? All right, I need to remember to use, be, become small a little bit more often. But now that I know that I have some charms that I like, I don't plan on getting too many more. Uh, oh, I can't quite get that, that's fine. And I get hit by that. You know what, I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna keep going. I think we can survive this still. I'll just focus on getting more weapons now with all the coins that I have. I don't have too many coins right now, so we can probably, we'll probably have to do another running gun level. All right, get rid of this, get rid of this. Now I just need to try to dodge the, the little shurikens a little bit better, which should be easier when I actually remember to go into small mode. It's just such a weird thing. I'm not like, I wouldn't think that was something, you know, that would be in the game. It's just, you can go small normally. It's not a special ability or anything. It's just what you do. So I'm never just expecting it. All right, so you're gonna, yeah, boom. Okay, so that's gonna help, surely, right? Now this just isn't fun at all. No, it's okay, so you can't parry these guys. They don't do much. So they sort of have like a bit of a pink outline, so I thought that maybe, but no, you can't parry them. At least not the ones I was trying to parry. All right. Oh, okay, I dodged that pretty decently. Oh, okay, so I got that phase. He's hopping away. I don't think we're quite done. I just still can't get over how cool this background is. Whoa, he's like hypnotizing me or something. Whoa, what is happening? Okay, now he's a puppet master. Oh, he's making fun of me. Oh, I see. I see, you're just trying to make fun. You're trying to have a little joke at my expense. Or I guess at Cuphead's expense, which seeing how we're playing as Cuphead, might as well be my expense. Oh, darn. Almost weed through that. That was the farthest we got halfway through. The, be the beating was for free. No strings attached. Ooh, I like that. We were more than halfway through then. Okay. Cool that you are all, all are sharing your stop motion stories. It's free and it's for the plane levels. Is it in a shop then? I'm a little confused at what you mean. Like there's a shop in the second world and there's a free upgrade. Because if so, I'll go check that out. But I thought that I went up to everything. All right, so I actually got through that without taking any damage, it's pretty good. I mean, so far we're doing pretty good. We got halfway out through, and then I run into the easiest thing in the boss battle. <laughs> oh boy, go, 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 go. Got it. Oh, these little shurikens are always a pain in the booty. I don't know if I should be using the joystick or the D-pad for these levels. It's hard to tell sometimes what I should be doing what will be best. It sort of seems like a mixture between the two is always a good choice. All right, so you're gonna open up. I'm going to open up as well. Open up my emotions. So that did hit him. I'll make this a bit easier. There we go. We're gonna shoot out another one of those and I'm gonna move between it. 
There you go. Sort of getting used to that. It's just the ghosts make it a little bit more difficult. Obviously, that's sort of the point, but we got him. He's hopping away again. So what's the phase after this? I already forget. Uh, oh yeah, it's, it's this guy. Which wasn't too bad, I just sort of made a silly mistake. I really wasn't knowing what I was getting myself into. Or at least, you know, as far as I got, didn't seem to be too bad. I mean, maybe I'm totally wrong here and I'll instantly get destroyed, but I can get that more easily this time. We can tell there's actually a bit of a, oh, I got that, I got that. I don't know if I should use the bomb just yet, but I might be forced to in a moment. You know what, we're doing it, we're doing it, and I wasted it. <laughs> okay, well, you live and you learn, don't you? Oh, we got him, but this guy's little hat is still shooting and there's no way to destroy this thing. Oh, hey, you're huge. Living it up, aren't you? I have no idea what I can hit here and what I can't. So I'm just holding on. We're almost back up to our super. I don't think I can, I don't wanna get hit, but excuse me, excuse me. We were that close, Mr. Pyramid, and you ruined it. All right, let me uh, catch up with what you guys are saying. Uh, it's the dude that gave you the arrow point. Oh yeah, let me go, go check that out. Okie doke. All right, hello, sir. Hello. Good timing, fellas. I just added an upgrade on your airplanes. Now you can wallop your foes with bombs. Just switch your weapon whenever it strikes your fancy. Try it out. Your airplanes are now equipped with mini bombs. Switch your weapon anytime during battle. So I'm guessing with the same weapon switching buttons. We'll see if that helps. I mean, I can only assume so. They wouldn't put it next to a boss where it wouldn't be helpful. All right, from the top. Great plan and then some, if you say so. Um, I'm pressing the wrong button, so that doesn't help. Oh wow, okay, they are seemingly very interesting, but might depend on the situation on when I can use these. Because um, obviously, like when I'm backing up from these guys. All right, so there, there's no miniature version of that shot, though. I can, okay, you, this is a very weird, I'm not used to these swords. Oh, get that, oh, okay, I'll have another opportunity, right? Yep, oh, but I missed it. <laughs> I got a couple of them, though, that's fine. All right, now we're here. I think I'm just gonna use the straight shot for this one because it's already hard enough to dodge everything. Okay, move it. Get like that, good, good, good. Go through there. Oh, okay, I dodged it, I dodged it. Look at me, look at me. Oh, <laughs> all right, all right, awesome. All right, we'll see. Switch it like that and I will still become a bomb here because I should be able to earn up another one for that next phase, which I don't like. I mean, not for the next phase, but for the last phase. It is very weird to use it though. I'm trying, I'm trying. I, I might have to just get used to it. Oh, I see why it's helpful though. It's because you can avoid that very easily. All right. I'm afraid I'm gonna like shoot it over him, but I guess not, okay. So far, so good. I appreciate the suggestion because we're going into this final, or not final, but second to final piece with uh, full HP, so I just need to not get hit three times here. Oh boy. But it seems like most bosses seem to have about four phases. That seems to be average, which is another thing that's against the status quo of other platformers. Most platformers, when they're bosses, you know, they usually have three. But seeing how this game is more focused on the boss fights, I can imagine it only makes sense for them to have longer, more in-depth boss fights. So I could use the super bomb right now, and I'm tempted to with how these guys are treating me. All right, he's wiggling away. You better wiggle. Okay, so now we're doing this. I'm gonna go into the super then. I'm gonna try to just get over there as quickly as I can. Boom, just like that. And then I'll try to get back to this, but okay, so I see this dude right here, the pyramid. Oh, that is so very weird. That is so very weird. Um, okay, so I have another one of these. Ooh, oh, we got him. I was about to get taken up there. Ooh, yeah, see, I would have gotten hit by that pyramid. <laughs> he's coughing. That wasn't bad. Comparatively, that was like a third of the time that we had to deal with all the other bosses. Awesome. How much was that? Two minutes, 14 seconds. I had one out of three HP. Looking pretty good if you ask me. Two, skill level. And we get a B plus again. I don't really have a particular favorite stop motion video. I just like them all.